Good morning, December the 21st and I've just popped over to Coy Water Barn to have a look at some new fish that came in yesterday evening. Uh, I got a message the other day from Keith telling me that some uh, Easter and Eastside shower um, which Tony Pitham showed me photographs of when I was in Japan and had dinner with him back in uh, October were arriving uh, yesterday evening. Um, some really interesting looking fish amongst these. Um, so what we're going to do today is pull some of those up and just take a quick look at those. As everybody knows, I'm a real fan of Issa Shower. So I'm going to pop inside now and take a look at them fish. So Keith Holmes, Koi Water Barn. So these Issa Shower that uh, we're going to take a look at today, give me a little bit more information about them. Paul. Yeah, okay Mark. Um, well these were selected um, last October by Tony on his um, autumn harvest trip. A um, little bit of a story behind these fish. Um, these were these were all Issa from Issa, um, all Issa Shower. Um, these were kept at Issa uh, in a concrete pond. So hence why they're a bit smaller for for these side because they've they're been grown on indoors. Um, they were sold to a client, but they were never collected. So the Rita then brought them, um, and then when Tony was, was visiting the Rita Kai farm last October, he was offered the opportunity to purchase a, a number of these, which have come in, and as we'll see, they're extremely good quality uh, Easter shower. So what sort of size are they? I mean, when we say they're small, I mean, that, 40, I always need to put that into perspective. <laughs> Forty-five, fifty. Yeah. Um, um, that sort of region. Yeah, so, so not small, small, but they're absolutely. not 55, 60. Yeah. A lot of people um, now. But genetically, they're not small fish. No, um, no, potentially, no. they can catch up very easily to what would be a normal Easter shower within a space of a year or two. Absolutely, yeah. Given the right conditions, yeah, no, no reason why they can't, can't get to their full potential. Okay, great. Let's take a look at some, some of them closer in the bowl. So we just netted all like 27, 28, Andrew? 28. 28 of the fish out uh, into some bowls. This bowl here, as I quickly look through them, perhaps my favourite six. Probably when we start going through the others, I go, oh, maybe not. Um, but I think these are very, very nice Nisa, uh, Isa Nisa shower. Um, something that's very Characteristic of Issa Shoa, we see an awful lot. These small bendy patterns, which these two here at the top of the screen exhibit. And there's plenty, plenty of evidence on those fish to suggest that soon he's going to come up. And one of the things about Issa Shoa is the thick jet black sumi that they obtain. Um, and the skin on these fish, considering they came in yesterday. Yesterday evening, how long they've been here, Keith? Not, not 12 hours. So, they arrived here yesterday evening at the barn, yeah? About, about half 10, 11 they were introduced. So yeah, so not even 12 hours ago, these have come out of boxes from their, their journey from Nagoya, in the region of supremacies in Nagoya. Um, and extremely, extremely attractive. I think if I had to pick a single individual one as my favorite, uh, it's certainly between these two, I think. Uh, I think I would probably have to guess, go with this one here in the middle of the shot now. My favourite. Um, that's without giving any real consideration to whether they're male or female. And certainly no consideration to what, what price they're priced at on, on the Koi Ward Barn website. Uh, but we're going to take individual shots of, of these half a dozen and then some more bowl shots 
of some more of the fish. Here we have second bowl of, of six fish just randomly picked out by Andrew. Um, everything in the bowl has, you know, there's some really nice characteristics um, about everything in the bowl really. Um, several of these I suspect very much are male. Um, this Maritain, I'm pretty sure, will appeal to an awful lot of people. Um, I'm guessing 100% that's a male fish, but if that doesn't concern you, you can see the start of what I talked about as far as how good Isasumi is, um, considering it's been in a bag for a long time as it was shipped here to England. Already this Sumi has come back and as it stays here in the cooler water I suspect will come up a lot more. This fish next to it, another fish, um, again, suspect probably male, but very nice qualities about it. But it's a very interesting fish. If people are looking for some Easter shower to grow on, very attractive koi amongst them. This one here, perhaps my pick of the bowl, one in the middle. So we'll get these photographed and then we'll show you another bowl, uh, another group of six in a little while. Uh, another bowl of six of the Easter shower. And as with the last bowl, Every one of these has some interesting and attractive characteristics. This one in the center. And there was a lovely strong sumi patch on the shoulder. And if we look further down the body, again, sumi to come here to balance on the, the other side. this one here in the center of the bowl now, perhaps my favorite in the bowl. As I mentioned earlier in the video, this sumi style that wraps between the red patterns, and we see that here on this particular fish. And the sumi is just on the white ground. So again, perhaps one of the smaller fish in the bowl, but would suggest probably my favourite in the bowl as well. Here we have fish 19 to 24 from the batch. All those numbers mean anything in relation to the website or anything. Uh, just the 19th to the 24th we videoed. Again, the selection's been made in no particular order. And again, some very interesting, nice fishing here. This one on the left hand side. Small possibly male, but has really attractive characteristics about it. As I say on, or repeated so many times probably on this video, Sumi, where the Sumi falls on the white ground, works around the red. Lovely, what he used to call a Sagi Sumi, this blue style Sumi, which he used to really rate very highly on this particular fish. And then, Large one, very attractive head pattern. Interesting head pattern.
Here we have the final four of the Nissan Shower. Not the final four for any particular reason, just that's how they came out. Two of these are actually, I understand, purchased as part of a, or offered as part of the Narita sales event which took place at the beginning of October. And that being the one on the left hand side as we look now, and this one at the bottom. In fact, I kind of think I included this on a preview of that event on Nishigoi.life, this particular one. Certainly a fish I remember being at that event. So there we are, so 28 Isa Nisai Shower. Available here, just coming in at the Koi Water Barn. And uh, you can find out more details on the Koi Water Barn website, which is koiwaterbarn.com.